it's what's saying is that he rolled a one. <laughs> uh, at some point, I need to have you teleported off to some other parallel dimension. <laughs> If it does happen, I hope that you actually let me play that out. Just random encounter where all of a sudden the entire counter changes and there's six others of me that and I disappear for, you know, three rounds. Alright. Ogre two, one, two, three, oh, D six. One to three is Henry's and then Yeah. Okay, I still have plus two AC, so I have twenty-two. Yeah. Oh, I was adding plus two to his hit. That's not fair. Ow. Oh, uh, yeah, that's it. That's still a hit. Yeah, you know what she can do about that. Ooh. Yeah, welcome to losing thing permanent. Ouch. Right, I've lost one D four. Yep, I got it. Ah, I keep rolling it off the board. Two. I do that Ooh. sometimes. That's bad. That's minus one strength, I think. Let's see. Broken arm. One d ten damage. Ooh. Ooh. Permanent loss, loss of strength. strength. Ouch. The thing is, I'm reading under lay on hands that you can heal like broken limbs. Yeah. Yeah, but you cannot, in the same action, also heal damage. Yeah, but does that mean we can undo this permanent stuff, or...? Not the permanent stuff, but you can get rid of the link. Uh, didn't somebody get restore abilities that uh, fixes stuff like that? Maybe. Possibly. Mm -hmm. Basically, I can fix your leg, but you're still going to have that minus five. It's never going to be fixed because quite properly. Yeah. So yeah, minus one strength. Yeah, I got it, and I need to take 1d10 damage. And considering I only have one wound left. Good yeah, night. yo. <laughs> you only have one wound left? Holy shit. Now, it is possible that we all screw up healing you when it, when that turn comes around. Mm. Yeah, right. but you've got three turns to actually heal him. I'm gonna shoot it over too. This is a backstab, right? Yep. We're all wondering where the fuck you've run off to at this point. Well, I'm all won wondering where the hell hey, I- Hey, you actually hit something. Congratulations. Amazing. I can't remember what backstabbing actually does for the damage, isn't it? Like, It changes the damage dice for some weapon, but I don't think crossbow is one of them. Ah, uh, true. So just- If the, if he hits, he automatically achieves a critical, too. Okay, so- there's the damage. Oh, very nice. And, um... So, crit against it. Uh, huh? you're level 3, right? Yes. Roll a 1d14. I think that's the right one. Yep. Uh, minus one four. Don't know, we'll take, we'll take the 4. Okay, okay, blow to chest, it staggers foe. You may make an immediate free attack. With your repeating crossbow. It's crazy. <laughs> Those are a real thing. <laughs> Do I actually take the repeating attack or Yeah you get hit yep. So it's a crit effect. It's not awful. Same thing. roll? Same you roll or new roll. For a really long time. Yeah. New roll or just same roll? Uh, new roll. I don't okay, think this so I don't get the sneak backstab back. because that would be like that would just chain to hell and back. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter. You slap at you one in quite quickly. Okay, at this point, I'm just going to go to his dead. <laughs> um, as every Henry in the universe um, opens up on him. Yeah, <laughs> it's not good. <laughs> There's ju it just sort of uh, it disappears into a mesh of uh, force axes. There it is for a very brief second a ogre shaped <laughs> spray of blood in the air. It all goes over. And it's all perfectly matched to uh, spray all that Gummy Crusher. So, do you want to try and use that to intimidate Gummy Crusher into. Hell like... yes. So, Henry. Uh, 
make me a personality check. Personality check with Henry? Yep. You well, can that's have a, a good luck, because I'm at one. You, you can have a plus, maybe we're, you can have a plus five. Henry's? Yeah, you can have a plus five bonus. Oh, so I'm at plus two. Woohoo! Yeah, good. Oh, the other Henry's. You speak in uh, unison. Somehow you know what you're going to say, and you're all speaking in unison. Yeah, it's confusing. Yep. I somehow did it. <laughs> yep, that'll probably be enough to get him to stand down. Because you are know, all speaking in a really, really creepy monotone. Because you, even though you haven't got this planned, you all know you're all the same person. You know exactly what you would do in this situation. <laughs> yep. <laughs> At this point, I'm very well acquainted with just casting giant person on Abusius and then, uh, you know, sudden missile Murdering death. everything. Abusius yeah. is still busy dying. By the way, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, that's what two clerics are for. John Luke, go fix him. Okay, let's try. Limps over his uh, broken leg. Yep. What what alignment is uh? MD no. Okay, so no. Jason. So oh, I've lost the spell. <laughs> Sixteen uh, is. I mean, I've lost two dice. Three D oh, two. Okay, so two for, dice. Two, for what, Jason. what did dice or what did dice or Abdesius? Twelve, I believe. Oh yeah. Which is the D twelve? now? It's the one between the twenty and the ten. No, that was. Yep. Yeah, sorry, I got the wrong one. But I think I have to undead you. Yeah, it's got three wounds left, but yeah. Actually, um, didn't the giant enlarge spell give him two HP? Nope. 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 Uh, no, I don't have anyway. So, so. Right. Yeah. Though we didn't hear anything before that, so. Alright, we should probably have you lay on hands and heal your legs and arms and stuff. Well, well we can. We can do that once we've got this guy actually doing what we want him to do. Yeah. Okay, <coughs> I'm gonna step away. He's dropped his mace. So. I'm gonna stand over he's here. Still, okay? He's still an ogre. Yeah. So yeah, Shay's gonna walk forward, give him the whole... It's the, I don't know what he actually says at this point, just probably go to this island now, Cthulhu said so. He's talking to an ogre, it's probably the best thing you could do. <laughs> Luckily he's an ogre and pretty much, oh yeah, Cthulhu say this, we go. Dun, 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 we should have we should have led, led with this. He didn't give you the opportunity to be fair. Yeah, he kind of, he kind of swung first, asked questions later. He's Ask ogre. questions, never. He's an ogre. So yeah, let's try to fix our broken leg and arms. I did some actual damage to you, I'm happy. Yeah, nearly killed two of us. If there was an extra ogre, you may actually have succeeded at it, doing it. Yeah, that's why I deleted one extra before the thing started. Mm. So yeah, uh, how does he... Fixing broken things work. Okay, so it's basically uh, you if, to fix broken limbs. You need one uh, dice worth of damage. So let's just pass the test. Okay, so well, okay, well, may as well. Okay, my broken arm is my well, leg is healed. I'll do the arm then. Yep, and I fucked up the second one, so. I'm still busted, and I think we don't we lose those spells now. No, we're clerics. Clerics don't. We get disapproval. Can you just keep doing it? it? Yeah, you keep, keep oh, doing. Yeah. yeah. Uh, John Luke <laughs> is actually. Yeah, Shay now is just dis hits disapproval. Out. Uh, disapproval. It, it's now two because it was one, 
but you oh, just I failed. I did, yeah. It automatically increases. Disapproval. I forget where that chart is. Okay, there we go. Your arm's fixed. Well, <laughs> mostly fixed. Yeah, I got a trick elbow, but thankfully my stats are high enough that it doesn't affect my modifiers. Yeah, the five foot uh, combat speed loss is a bit of a problem, though. John Luke with a limp. I, I can't beseech Yig for a snake leg or something, can I? 1d4 for every point on the spell check. Okay, so 2d4. Of what? Damage or disapproval? disapproval. Five. The cleric must undergo the test of humility. For the remainder of the day, he must defer to all other characters and creatures as if they were his superiors. Hello. Um, and that's any different <laughs> from how? <laughs> Failure at the discretion of the judge means he immediately loses all spellcasting ability, including healing and laying on hands for the remainder of the day. So what you're saying is I can summon a lot of snake snakes and tell you that you should carry them. <laughs> yes. Insofar as that would probably snap his spine, that's not, not a good that plan. But Not that many snakes. You under he is. What's his strength? Eleven. Here's the it's thing, do I want to yes. want to risk losing the snake spell? Yeah, I'm just gonna throw over uh, an arm over Shay's shoulder and say, carry me back to the raft or I'll be Now there is nothing that says I have to be polite about this. No. Well no, you have to be deferential. Yes, that's your, how, is this the, your how, differ, how differential? Well, uh, how, how would you talk to your boss at work? Um, Depends on the job. Well, in this case, being fired means losing your spells for the rest of the day. For the rest wow. of the day. Yeah, so you probably don't have to care. Yeah, you could just I say mean, bugger off. I will still do it, but it'll be really sarcastic about the whole thing. I mean, as long as we don't get jumped by something now. Nope. Okay. okay. Oh, wait. Yeah, there Did is a... Oh, wait. <laughs> Sorry. No. Yeah, no, this is where the hounds turn up. Yeah. Really, uh, or...? Yep. Yeah. Well, you're in the middle of the wilderness now, aren't you? Yeah, I thought it would be. So wait, how does this work with conflicting orders or whatever? What do you mean conflict? Because if I get told to kill these things, but I'm supposed to act like they're my superiors... No, they, they well, are monsters, they, you don't have to worry about them. Yeah, they can't tell you to do something, they just hound. That's true, actually. So yeah, just as you think everything's neat and you know got nice and quiet, a bunch of hounds pop. Quiet. Yeah, a bunch of hounds pop into existence. All right. <coughs> and oh, see the crusher all around. No, he's wandered off. They it looks like the hounds actually wait until he wanders off until they uh, arrive. For good Getting reason. Smarter. Yep, there are an extra two, but they're chasing each other, so I'm not going to show. <laughs> Chasing each other. Yeah. Yeah, I marked two of the hounds. Remember? Oh. So <laughs> <laughs> if you don't like to roll your initiative, you've got a chance this time. They only rolled a ten. Hmm. Oh, it's time for more combat. So, um, initiative. Hey. I bugged it up. Jay actually rolled initiative for once. What the fuck? <coughs> I just rolled two tens. Well, no, you rolled an eleven and a nine, but two tens. Well, that's okay, the end Dumas result. Is up. So, does that mean I go after the hounds or before? Hey, it'll what probably, put, it'll probably put you before. I think that means. Yeah, I think characters... You just messed up your spell. Wait, I've, I can't remember this one of the ones that doesn't... You don't lose. Oh, 
What page is Flaming Hands on? 140. <clears throat> Wizard spells get lost on no. 11 unless you're a level 2 spell. Yeah, th there's some that... Okay, yeah, I lost it, damn. Your Flaming Hands says a lot. So, I wonder what happens if one of my uh, alternates gets marked by the Tendalos. It's about that they've gone already. They can come back. Tendalos just sort of looks at his hands dejectedly for a few seconds. To be honest, you should be rolling more ones with these spells. That's where the fun comes in. Yeah, but it's actually... I mean, the odds of rolling a one... One in twenty. Five yeah, percent. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna... Yeah. I'm going to stand in front of Shay and get ready to hit any hounds that try to run past me. Alright. Here they come. Oh boy. Hey. A miss. Not bad. And then another one. But this is actually the best person to do this. Yeah, more or less. Remember, they're also going after Henry. Also, both uh, of those would have missed Shea anyway. He's got yeah. 14 AC. This guy looks like he can go after Henry. Oh, yeah. I know I'm not going to have many chances to use these guys, so... Ow. Ow. Well, it's going to be worse. At least you can't be marked again. I think Edward needs a bite. Oh uh, joy, that's three of us. Hooray! Especially since that was exactly the amount that of my armor is on this guy. Oh, I just want to do that. There we go. And the last one. Five. Ooh, does okay, he go, go for John Luke? No, he doesn't. Yeah, I think John Luke's the only safe one. John Luke's having a bad day. A very bad day. It's, it's it getting worse. Get worse. Especially yeah. since you keep rolling freaking high on the ones that are very lowly armored. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, now Edward. It's Radical Edward. Don't run, it won't help. Nope, not gonna help. So, um... I'm just gonna do this. You know, I should have summoned snakes earlier. They would have still stuck around. Nope. Now, Henry. What you want to do that thing of yours? The one where all of a sudden there's more of you. I'm casting enlarge on Abdesius, of course. <laughs> Isn't Abdesius already enlarged? <laughs> no, it's, no, that wore off. It wore off. I thought it lasted longer. 19. He gets plus 2. It helps. Attack, damage, and AC, yes. Yeah. <clears throat> and how many extra Henry's? Alright, 1d8. 300. Oh, 5. 5. Oh, 5. It's 1d7 yeah. plus 1. I'm just rolling 1d8s. John Luke is a hound gnawing on your newly broken leg. I know, it hurts. Actually, that, that was fixed. Well, no, it's still... Well, I mean, You're it's really got the... It's got a limp in it, but, you know. Uh, I'm gonna summon snakes. In the original meme. Uh, I'm next to that summon again. What, what page is this? Oh, 280. Rolled a what? 16? 18. Oh, 18. No, it doesn't matter, it's the same thing. Uh, okay, I don't actually summon any snakes, but nearby snakes submit to my bidding. 100 foot range. It's We're in a swamp. swamp. Surely there are snakes. Yeah. Well, there should be a bunch. Especially since you've been adding a bunch of serpents to the aisles. Yeah. 
Go on then, I'll give you a couple of snakes. Yay. Because I'm a Anonymous nice chip. Well, the British yeah. Isles, they'll be, um, like... Yeah, there'll be cobras that survived from previous encounters. Did yeah, no, Venom this... even work on hounds? We discovered it did. Oh, cool. Wait, so... Oh, okay. These guys have followed you, been following you around, apparently. Hey, oh. guess what I'm gonna do to these guys? Oh, they should also get an... Oh, okay, they're at the... Ooh, wow, they at the start of the initiative. That's useful. Yep. Damn it. You're not gonna do whatever you were going to do. The same thing I did last time. The reason we only have five to worry about instead of seven. Yeah. Do it! I Mark more hounds with themselves. <coughs> Like Chris, he's here, this I can group. try again at the end of the at my next turn, but this one leaps to uh, his aid. Ank. Yes, that's a hit. Good snake. It's a leaping cobra. <laughs> the most fearsome of all cobras. Now the hound has to make a fortitude save. Yay. Oops. Is it failing? <laughs> yep. Right in the jugular. <laughs> Poor Hound 5. So what oh. happens to it? Uh, it kind of just dissolves, but... <laughs> <laughs> Snakes <laughs> continues to solve every single problem. <clears throat> Oop, okay, do that again. Nope. That one just bit itself. I don't know, that's like the monster yeah. fumble chart. Uh, so. Have a chart? Yeah, it's a table M monsters. Snake bites itself on the tail, becomes a Ruberos, ascends. Uh, right, so it's 2d8 hit dice. So, I keep getting what it is to figure out how many. 2d2. All of uh, is one D eight. Oh, it's f I'm looking at the fumble table. Aren't the table? Sorry, I look at the uh, wrong table. It's a, it's a generic fumble table. Oh. Alright, fumbles. You drop your weapon. You must retrieve it or draw a new one. Can teeth fall off? <laughs> Possibly. As it turns out, hounds have scales. This one does anyway. Very tough scales. Okay, right. Tomas. You've basically lost all actual function. Oh wait, I have animal summoning. Wolves to me. Oh boy. Hey, it works. Oh dear. How many wolves do you summon? I don't know. 129. Mini. 20 to 23. Caster summons one main un mundane animal of up to four hit dice, two of two, or four of one. Wolves of one. So help me four, four wolves. That works for me. Wolfen. Animals obey the caster's commands within normal bounds. Suicidal commands are those contrary to its nature have a 25% chance of releasing the animal from service. Wait, didn't you roll 20? Oh, so yes. you got four wolves. Okay. Yep. Apparently, you guys just like fighting your um, battles with the uh, forces of nature. That's because it works. Are these wolves actually land squids? No, they're actual wolves, they're just a bit lost. If I had land squid scale, I would be using land squids, okay? Well, I mean, your patron deity is Cthulhu. Surely no, the wolves are a little tentacle. Not, you're not using the cleric. That was Tomas. Oh, oh, you Alright. My wizard's patron is Oberon. 
Oh yeah. Hey, uh, welcome to the market club. Uh, that actually misses because I have a plus two to AC. Oh yep, yeah, you're right. Take those wounds back. And unmarked. I have to fill that in manually. So what I'll do is actually put a minus two modifier onto this. That's the simplest way to do it. Yeah, that works. It doesn't. Oh, did that hit anyway? Yeah. Yep. He, he put in the minus two, so yeah, that hit. Ank. Ooh. Okay, now welcome to the marked club. Is that the whole party now? Um. Pass the to Mas. Except to Mas. And of course, the people who aren't here. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Well, please for you. At least you've all got a reason to worry now. I think. Okay. Continue to chow down on Wizard. Actually, now I've got a roll, haven't I? 1d6. Yeah, which Wizard? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's true. You're the. Oh, actually, I should have said which one do you want to be? Z1 or 6? Before I rolled roll again. Call the flip, Zeb. Zeb. Yeah. 